I just want you to know that if Trayvon had been alive, he would be right here on these Hello. steps with you guys rallying yeah. for justice. Yeah. Trayvon Martin was here. Trayvon Martin did matter. Yeah. I just so want you to you know that we're not going to stop until we get justice right. for Trayvon. Yeah. Now we will hear from Ms. Sabrina Fulton, Trayvon's mother. Was not committing any crime? No. no. Our son is your son. Yeah. yeah. You got to stand up for justice and stand up for what's right. Yeah. This is not about a black and white thing. No. This is about a right and wrong thing. Yeah. Trayvon right now. When you first heard about what happened to Trayvon, uh, how did it impact you? Okay, when I first heard about Trayvon, I immediately thought about my own son. Mm. You know, he's a young black male, I'm a young black male, and you know, we, I come from Brownsville, Brooklyn, this could have easily been him. So I explained that in point that this also has direct correlation with the stop at first that we see in the uh, We don't have, um, we, we, we're not protecting our own. Again, this, this could easily have been somebody up in New York or somebody in California or somebody in New Jersey. It could have been anybody. So we all are all Trayvon. I, I specifically went and bought a hoodie to represent, to represent what Trayvon. Wow, wow. So, because again, this, this could have been any, any one of us. Yes, sir. It, it, it had to be a child.